There's a rough going on these old bones. But what if he, if he returns today? Can't let the lighthouse stay dark. I doubt we'll have much luck blundering around blindly for a shaman fish. You got a better idea? Perhaps we could try asking some of the townspeople for advice. Now see, Vice, why didn't you say that in the first place instead of being so surly about it? There's someone behind me being creepy. Hello. This town didn't become a trade hub until the world sank into the ocean. I'm sure other people weren't happy, but it was great for us. Men of the sea have a bad temper. The women are even worse. You'd, you'd best mind your manners. Thanks for the warning. So the, the world sank to the ocean? Interesting. So that, that explains why everything's so desolate and spread out. If everyone had to relocate to entirely new locations. Since, a lot of, since the majority of the world's population is uh, near coastlines. Depends a bit on just how much it sank, I suppose. This place is a labyrinth. Wow. Okay. So that lady seems to have like a... She probably has like a love story or something going on there where somebody went out to the ocean and is lost at sea and she probably continues to wonder when they're going to come back and hope, beyond hope, that it'll still happen. So she probably goes back and makes sure that the lighthouse is kept lit every day. Not because it's a service to the city, but because specifically... She has her own motivation to deal with it. Was there a saved point? I think I saw a red spot back here. Nope. Oh, I can go inside. Oh, there's a save point. I'm not crazy. Cool. Now I've got to save here in town. So what's in here, whatever this place is? My leg's still bothering me. I don't think I can get back to my rounds for a bit. Okay. Oh, now we're doing top-down. Now they're just being cute about it. Oh, is this, this is a sliding block puzzle. Okay. Yeah, no... Yeah, I'm not allowed to jump. I have to push it, right? Yeah, if I pulled it, I can't go past it. At that point, I can push one or the other. I guess I can, since I can pull them, there's no real reason not to just push them all the way. Let's see. Actually, huh. I'm just thinking, like, if I got it out, I might be able to push this one on the bottom all the way out, off to the right to get out of the way at some point. For now, let's just try the obvious solution and see if it works before I overthink things. So that won't work. So I can't pull you against the wall. I can't pull you back here. I can't push you now because that thing's there. Okay. And you can't... Yeah, you can only push them and pull them. You can't push them, move them sideways. Okay. That didn't really help, did it? Not really. I guess I can get be I can get behind this if I pull this down. There we go. And I'm just intruding in this guy's stuff now at this point. Uh Why did I come here? <laughs> why did I come here? There's nothing to interact with as far as I can tell. Nope, I'm just sneaking into this guy's house being a creeper. Uh, and I see no other evidence of there being any items lying around either, and I can't attack. Weird detail. 
Yeah, and he's it's he's not he wasn't even all like, can you unblock this path so I can get in? Like he he wasn't even asking for me to do that. So I don't know what the point of that was if there was one even. Maybe other similar locations will actually uh, require you to solve them to get through to something, and that was like a practice room, just for the sake of it. Let's see, I'll check around the fountain real quick because that seemed like a whole area. But I think my ultimate goal is probably to get up on the uh, up to the lighthouse, since they made a point of showing it to me. There's someone. Shaman fist? Fish? Uh, try asking the old man up by the quay. If anyone knows, it'll be him. The quay. Go like golden... Like, are the key? Is it called a key? Like golden key? Golden key? In, uh... That freaking, uh... <laughs> that location in, uh... In Final Fantasy XV, actually. The place that looks like it would not in, e in any case ever be pronounced the way that it's spelled. But it turns out it is. Don't see much back there. So, this is probably a fishing location. Is this the spot? He looks like an old man. Oh. Ah, uh, shaman fish. Oh, sure, sure. I'd catch you one of them without ever trying. But why give a feller a fish when you can teach him? Here, oh, I accidentally pressed A. You can catch the shaman fish on the beach. How do you fish? Is that a serious question? You gotta move your body away from where the fish is going, got it? Here. Let me give you a lure while I'm at it. Fishing's a test of wills between man and beast. Never give up the fight. Guess we better find a good fishing spot. Obtain the fishing rod and lure. Press, uh, when B fish is displayed on the screen, press B to choose your bait and begin fishing. If, when your rod bends, press A to reel the, in the fish. And, uh, press left stick in the direction of the opposite way the fish is going to reduce hit points. When the fish hit points re re uh, reach a zero, you'll automatically land it. Sounds al almost exactly like how fishing works in Final Fantasy XV, actually. <laughs> now the, the excitement ensues. No? I got nothing. I hit A right when it did that. Come on. Okay. Oh! I remember now. I think I remember reading about- Whoa, look at that. Just hanging out, unfazed by everyone. Okay. Neat. So I think I remember what what I read online like six years ago or whatever when I first played this game. I think I, I, think I tried to fish here for like half an hour and never had any luck. And I looked up online, and I think I found out... Well, there's a bunch of them here, actually. I think I found that this is supposed to be, like, a high-level or difficult fishing location, and this is supposed to be, like, a way easier one nearby. And that you should just go to some other beach and fish there instead. And people were like... I think I remember reading that people were, like, mad about that, because they're like, why would they do that? Like, it's clearly, like, the first place you get a chance to fish. Surely it should be, like, the easy tutorial location. But it's apparently, like, a super hard, messy location that's hard to get past. And that's rough because it's like a required, required for progress main quest situation where you have to fish. We'll see if I'm right or not. I could be completely dead wrong, but I think it might be like over here might be really easy. These guys are everywhere. Oh, there's dolphins out there. So I think this is the easy spot. Watching the lure. Oh, I was a little too early. Not even a nibble. Yeah, I was I was too early there. I saw it dip just slightly. Unfortunately, the game's so low. It's kind of a low resolution lure, and we're far away on the camera. Ah, damn it! Not even a nibble's not entirely true. Oh, that time the fish got away. Okay. I was gonna say it looked like it was going down. Come on, big pull. There's one. I'm pulling left. Oh, don't hit A, apparently. Just lean, I guess? Okay. 
Welcome to mandatory fishing. All right, so I made a mistake hitting A. Let's avoid that. I think you just hit A at the very beginning and that's it. Waiting for the big dip. There we go. I'm leaning away now. No, I must have to hit A. No? Because nothing was happening to his hit points. Did I mix up the button? Is it B? That's the wrong thing. There we go. Fishing, right? Different baits can catch, cause different fish to bite, even if you're fishing in the same spot. Completing certain quests will raise your fishing skill, making it easier to catch larger fish. But there's no, there's no fishing tutorial to remind me how to do it, is there? Crap. 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 I'll try, I'll, I guess, oh, fishing, there we go. Press left in the direction opposite the way the fish is going to reduce his hit points. What? That's what I was doing. It wasn't reducing its hit points at all. Part of me almost wonders if this is like mistranslated somehow and there's like something that's not quite coming across. So I'm holding right. All right. Okay, now it went the other way. Okay, now the hit points moved a little bit. So this is just gonna take forever. <laughs> oh, I have to pull back. Oh. You said push it the opposite way the fish is going, but you, have to, you also have to pull back. Okay, well, that was relatively painless. Perfect, let's get back, let's back to Yona. There we go. We can just probably stop doing that forever. <laughs> Weird. So you don't just so yeah. It felt logical to be like, oh, it moved right. So press left. You have to press back and left. Okay. And pressing A makes you lose. Now we know. The funny thing about the, a mechanic like that is that unless you really want to go at it for a long time, the average player's experience is going to be, how does this work? Um, I'm not really sure. And then they're gonna finally figure it out and then n never do it again. <laughs> So it's like, I'm sure glad I learned that skill to probably ignore forever. I'm not trying to sound rough on the game, it's just I'm rough on fishing mechanics specifically, mostly. <laughs> Whew, I'm so tired. That's the woman we saw a moment ago. What? Really? Odd. Oh, now. Okay. Huh? I said, hold it! Over here! How can you just ignore an old woman in need? Oh, I weep for this generation. I didn't try to ignore you, the game made me. The children of this age are nothing but selfish, heartless cads. Well, now I don't want to help you, but also I'm pretty sure I'm not a child by, like, any metric. Wait, are you talking about me? No, ignore her. We have a quest to complete. People like that are best left to their own devices. Oh! Oh! oh, oh the pain! What's wrong? My illness has returned. It must have been the shock of seeing this rude floating book. Rude? This book? Now see here, madam, I'll have you know. You! You did this! Oh, what a terrible thing you are! Why, you insolent crone! How dare you address me like some common paperback! Easy, boys. People don't normally talk to paperbacks, to be fair. You there! Boy! Would you truly abandon a pitiful old woman to this cruel world? Are you asking me? Oh, do please ask me. Heavens, I can't believe how much cajoling that took. You only asked once, really. You're welcome. I am at a loss as to what aid we could possibly give a woman who is so clearly able to talk her way into anything. I need you to go to the post office and tell them to deliver my mail. 
I can't fathom why they haven't been here yet. Oh, 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 oh the pain! Enough, we'll go to the post office. Just stop saying things. <laughs> That's an amazing response. Just stop saying things. For the love of God, just never speak again, please. So this must be the lighthouse she was hanging out at? It's way up here. Let's maybe avoid checking this out right now. My main objective is to go to the post office, and I get the feeling that if I do that, we may end up uh, coming up here anyway. Since it's apparently an entire chunk of the environment dedicated specifically to her. So I'll point out that you they have you catch a fish here, and then when you catch the fish, you, she materializes here. So it seems like they specifically require you to catch the fish there, which makes it all the more strange that there's clearly... There's clearly a coast, like, right next to where they give you the fishing rod. It smells like the sea. Yes, Gestalt! You figured it out. Congratulations. Also, just be warned, there may be something in this game that's actually called Gestalt, and it may have been a horrible mistake to name him Gestalt, but... Going back may be kind of pointless, because it's just his name popping up, so... If people ever actually use the name Gestalt, they're probably not referring to him. But also, I don't think anyone will ever use his name, so it shouldn't be that confusing. Afternoon. There's an old lady at the uh, the coast who wants her mail, badly. Oh, you mean the lighthouse lady? The very same. Now, can you please deliver her parcels and silence her flapping gums? Sorry, I, but I hurt my leg. I won't be delivering anything for a while. She won't like that at all. What's what about your sacred postman's oath? Never wind nor uh, neither wind nor sleet nor terrible monsters of the night shall keep thee from. Fine, I'll do it. Give me the mail. But, but the oath. Those slack jawed layabout had a duty to this town. Oh, that's a huge help. Thank you. Just uh, be careful, all right? Uh, that lady has a bit of a temper. You don't say. And now we have her letter. Oh, I can read it. Just be scummy about it. Um, you know, since... Oh, what is it now? Are you from Popola's village? How'd you know that? You're dressed differently from most folks. Anyway, would you mind taking this letter back to Popola when you return? Sure, why not? Now we have two letters. Ah, might as well take the postman's oath ourselves. Why not? Like, like we said, we like... We would like to work to make money. It'd be a good idea. Documents? This is the love letter. A letter from the lighthouse lady's absent lover. So she's alive? He's alive? I thought they'd be gone. My dearest beloved, please forgive the lateness of this letter. I have recently fallen quite ill and had some difficulty finding a doctor in this foreign land. The people here, however, have treated me with great kindness, and I now feel my body getting stronger by the day. If my recovery continues, I hope to attempt the journey home soon. I think about you every day, and yearn for the moment we can be together again. Please, take care of yourself, and know that I am doing everything I can to return to you. So they're alive, and apparently haven't been gone that long. Letter to Popola. I'm just reading people's mail. I'm pretty sure this is illegal in the real world, but I don't know if that applies here. From the office of the mayor of Seafront to Popola. I write to you regarding the urgent matter of the area. As you know, the shade activity in that area has been increasing of late, and we now fear the worst. Numerous letters to the village chief have yet to be returned, and our merchants have recently lost all contact with customers there. While Seafront has yet to be troubled by the shades, we fear their arrival is only a matter of time. I encourage your village to take all necessary steps to defend yourself from this terrible scourge. The loss of two outposts would be almost too much to bear. I hope to hear from you soon. And now we're a postman, apparently. Why not? Why not just become an actual postman? It's more income, right? What? This? This is the post office. Let's do a save, because we haven't done one for a while. Maybe I'll go help that lady with her, let her mail, and then we'll get ambushed by a super goliath monster on the beach. Or something. Anything's possible. It's, it's a JRPG. Monsters just happen in these kinds of games, seemingly at random. Where are you, old lady? With all your moaning, 
Is she gone? I don't hear the crone, and I'm sure I would if she were here. Folks call her the lighthouse lady, right? Well, let's go check the lighthouse. Yep, I figured as much. What an absurd waste of time this is. Still going to the lighthouse. And you can't stop me with all your whining. Enjoy the sense of powerlessness, you scum. <laughs> Here it is. Am I gonna go up this place spirally? I might. What's this? Oh, that's the door. Oh. Like, I'm gonna forget how I got inside. <laughs> okay. It's so far away from the door, it looks like it's gonna do something. Oh, look at this 2.5D thing going on. I enjoy the perspective stuff. There's not much to it, but it's just kind of a nice little change of pace from time to time. Coming in. Oh, you. What do you want? We have retrieved your letter. The postman hurt his leg. That's why he... That's no excuse. It's his job to deliver the mail no matter what. Didn't he take the postman's oath? The thought that anyone would actually bother to write you a letter staggers the imagination. Such a rude book. I'll have you know this is from someone very dear to me. Well, I suppose I should give you something for your trouble. Wow. Not bad. That's just the same dialogue again. And I guess we're leaving. Interesting. It's such an articulate, interesting, like, specifically important looking location, so I get the feeling we're gonna be coming back at some point. So much design went into this cool location, and it's just a tiny letter delivery quest that seems... It seems like it has to have more to it. We need to get the shaman fish to Yona. Yes, we do. Time for our return trip. Hip. So nice being able to jump around freely, not having to worry about some stupid parcel, because I already broke it. I think. I must have broken it. Yeah, yeah, I broke it during that first fight where somebody was in danger. Huh? The lighthouse lady. She's a mean old battle axe, that one. So I don't think I really saw quests lying around for the most part. Just another thing saying to go back to town. So we've we've led ourselves to another situation where once again I'm going back to town and I'm supposed to talk to Yona and po uh, pa Palolo, Palola, Palola. <laughs> Anything gonna happen on the return trip? Because last time we met lingerie lady, what was that? The heck was that? My entire screen just flashed. That seemed kind of important. Is that a spider monster? Uh, I'll take a quick look. Why was there a spider monster up here? Oh, that's just a spider. It's not even a shade. It's just a giant nightmare spider. Ugh. Stop living. Stop it. Nobody likes you. Just go away. I'm trying to be evasive so I don't get any hits, hopefully. It's almost down. Oh, he got me. Uh-oh. That's bad. I might get poisoned if I'm not careful. Oh, that's poison for sure. Well, crap. Do I have antidote? Antidotal weed. Probably a good idea just to use that before it gets worse. That's horrible. That's just a giant spider. Why would a spider charge? Seems like an, in a, an ill-advised combat style. It opens! What is this place? Why is it turning black and white? Can't go inside. Ah! Uh, the fact that the spiders take a, while, a little while to kill makes me think this is maybe a later later in the game area. Maybe I'll be sent here next. Interesting looking place. Weird how the color drains out of everything that's not me. At least these are quick areas. Don't attack me, I'm just trying to pick up the thing. Be nice. Oh. Someone's having a fight. Oh, health bar. What is that? Is that your health bar? Oh, crap. Oh yeah, you're like the thing I fought in the intro. Okay. 
I mean, I think melee was most effective last that when I was doing this fight before. Yeah, it chips away nicely. Let's be careful though. Oopsie. No. One hit. Oh. Do I load back into this map or by, or my save point? Ah. Okay. Cool. Wow. So I am not nearly as powerful as I was in the prologue, apparently. That kind of encounter is probably best avoided. I guess I'll run past it. Both that thing and the boar seem like later in the game encounters, judging by the, their ability to just obliterate me on a moment's notice. Kind of wish that the game indicated levels a bit. Like, I have a level, but what level, what level are enemies like that? Can I know? Seems like a random world boss or something. Well, at least the game's nice about checkpoints. Apparently, whenever I die, I restart that map or whatever. Which, like, so, uh, some games are a bit more aggressive with their checkpoint system, but I'll take that over, say, going back to your save point, which is uh, how a lot of games, a lot of J, uh, JRPGs in particular work. I mean, that's how... Oh, am I going that way yeah like that's how uh, Tokyo Mirage session worked and that was a 2016 game if you died ever you reverted all the way back to the last time you manually saved good luck Devola and Popola came to me uh, to keep me company today they even sang we're back inside broke that one guy's gift again though uh -huh. hey you there you seen my max around Sorry, I don't know, Max. Max is my dog. He's been missing since yesterday. Oh, I see. Uh, any idea where he went? He usually likes to run around the Northern Plains. Most of the time, he just comes and goes, but I haven't seen him in over 24 hours. Well, if I find him, I'll make sure to give him back. I'll bring him back. Oh, thank you. Huh? Something wrong there? Oh, it's nothing. Just, just a little choked up about my dog is all. Okay, well, try not to worry, all right? I'll do, I'll do what I can. I'm just a little choked up about my dog. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm gonna go back to the Northern Plains and probably see a really hard to catch dog sprinting around and that'll probably be a new thing to deal with. I assume I just have to run up and hit B on it. Maybe maybe I might have to bait it or something. In, in whenever, game, whenever games have dogs, they often are really suspicious in the moment. All right, well, we made the trip back. So we'll go ahead and update this real quick. There we go. Get used to that screen. <laughs> All right, always prioritize Yona first. Fish for Yona, then we deal with anyone else. Wait, was I supposed to take the fish directly to Yona or, or take it back to Palola? Crap. Well, I'm already here. So we'll just see how it goes. Dad, everything hurts. It's all right. I'm gonna make some medicine for you. It won't taste very good, but I need you to take it anyway. Okay, I'll take it. Good girl. Hi, Dad. How are you feeling? Great, the pain's totally gone. That's fantastic, Yona. That's really fantastic. I need to go talk to P uh, Popola. Stay here, get some rest, all right? All right. Oh, you're back. Hey, Dad. I think I want to try making stew. Do we have any venison or wheat? A deer, wheat, stew. Um, uh, that sounds that sounds nice, Yona. Get ready, stomach. This is gonna be rough. You accepted the quest. Yona's home cooking. Okay, Yona. Let me see if I can track down your ingredients. Really? Oh, thanks, Dad. I think you're really gonna like it. We'll see how it goes. Tiny girl trying to learn how to cook. What could go wrong? The important thing is she's not writhing in pain in bed. For a home cooked meal. Hmm? You got something to say? Oh no, 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 no! I have nothing at all. <laughs> Look, I know Yona's not a four-star chef or anything, but she puts her heart into it, and I love her for it. Only a real jerk wouldn't appreciate the effort. What kind of father do you think I am? 
Did you hear me imply anything of the sort? I guess not. Just, well, good luck. Yeah. Having some random, having some book try to act nonchalant is such a weird detail to have. So I didn't really see a farm. Maybe I'll check the, if there's tutorials on it or something. No, I, I think I checked already and there wasn't really anything helpful. Just, at least not one that specifically says how to farm. Thought there might be one in the yard in front of the house. Got a letter for you. Oh, thank you. Oh dear. What's wrong? It's from the mayor of Seafront. He says that a horde of shades have appeared in the area. That's bad news. My weapon was damn near useless against the one we faced there. Perhaps there's some way to strengthen that weapon. Uh, uh, perhaps there's a, some way to strengthen that weapon of yours. There's a shop at the entrance of the junk heap that might be able to help. If you bring them raw materials, they can make new and powerful weapons. Interesting. Guess I'll pay him a visit. Oh, but it's not free, you know. It'll cost you about a thousand gold or so. Got it. If you need money, try visiting the tavern. That's usually where people go when they're looking to hire someone. Thanks. I appreciate it. The tavern? Where? Oh, do you have a quest? Oh. Ah, good. Just the man I needed. Could you gather two medicinal herbs from the southern plains for me? I've been exhausted lately. I need a boost. I think I already have enough. They usually grow in patches of grass or by the base of trees. I don't think they'll be too hard to find. Two medicinal herbs? You got it. Just take it easy till I get back. Don't I already have those? Oh. Thanks for secur securing those herbs for me. It must be getting old. If I must be getting old if I need this stuff. Hey. That was easy. If you need money, try visiting the tavern. That's usually where people try to uh, go if they're trying to hire someone. Is there a tavern in town here? I actually don't know about that. I thought maybe maybe it's in the seafront or something, or the, or what they call the junk heap. World Purification Commission report. The first attachment is functioning properly. What? Might as well check out that tavern people people mentioned. Is that? Looks like it's right over here, apparently. Let's check the map. Oh yeah, it's right here. There must be a door I can open that I didn't notice. Should I check to see if these guys have new quests or not? Should probably check by each gate. Nothing at the moment. Should gather any herbs I can along the way. So I, I was at cap, but now I've spent some doing that. So the tavern should be somewhere on my left. Is it the, so it's not the stairs. Oh, there it is. Yep, yeah, just a random door I never noticed. Might have not even been open yet. Not sure. Hey, listen. Hey, you got a moment? Because I've got works for you. I'm pretty busy right now, but if you're paying, I'm listening. Fair enough. Listen, my granddaughter's low on, medic on medicine. I need you to gather some ingredients. I need three medicinal herbs, three berries, three royal ferns. You may have to leave the village to find some of it, so I hope it's not too much of a bother. I have at least two of those things, I think. The tavern's keeper's grandmother. Okay, tell your grandmother to hang in there, and I'll get back. Do I have Hello. it? I need... Okay. Same ingredients. Let's check. Okay, yeah, I don't have... I'm missing two royal ferns. I have tons of herbs. Venison and wheat. I know where to get a venison. I'm not sure about wheat. Hello. Hey. You ever heard Devola and Popola sing? Sure. Devola sings here all the time. I ain't talking about that. I'm talking about the two of them singing together. Uh, no. I've never seen that. They used to come here and sing all the time, but now they're so busy. Hey, you ought to get them back together and sing for us. The Ballad of the Twins. Well, I suppose I'm kind of curious. So she's moved in here now from the, uh... Like she was usually, on, she was previously on the, uh, the fountain. Kind of reinforces the idea that maybe this place was closed before. Hey. Can I ask you a favor, Davola? You're asking me a favor. Well, now I've heard everything. I heard you and Papola used to sing at the tavern. I never got a chance to hear it. So, wait. You want to hear us sing? <laughs> well, Papola's been swamped lately, so I haven't sung with her in forever. But if she's up for it, I'm willing. Oh, hey there. 
Wanna let a girl buy you a drink? A little early, isn't it? Ha! <laughs> when you live in a place where the sun never sets, what difference does it make? Wow, so apparently the sun never sets. New details. I love this tavern. It's the nerve center of the whole village. Folks come here to relax or swap so stories or even look for work. Come back here whenever you have a free minute. That's that then? All right. Is there really nothing that can cure the Black Scrawl? No medicine in the works of man can hope to stand against it. There has to be something. Perhaps a drug exists to temporarily ease the pain, but none can truly eradicate the disease. Damn it. But if the legend is true, then I hold the key to saving your girl. You're right. I have to hold on to that. Ha! Huh, that's the spirit. Awful inconvenient how you went and lost your memory. He blamed it on me, but that would be some really tragic writing if if the key to saving my daughter was lost because I bashed the thing on the head a lot when I was freeing it. Hey. Can I ask you a favor, Popola? Sure, what is it? I heard you and Davola used to sing at the tavern, and I was wondering... Oh my goodness, we haven't done that in a long time, and I don't... N no, I'm sorry, I don't think I can do it. Why not? Well, I need a certain drink before I can sing in public. I'm a little shy, if you know what I mean. It's a tavern, Papola, I'm sure they'll have it. Actually, they don't have this drink anymore. But they used to order it from a tavern in Seafront, so maybe you could ask there. And now I've got the follow-up. So if I go to the tavern all the way in Seafront, I... <laughs> I see what they're doing. They're being cute about uh, introducing me to both taverns back to back because the other tavern probably is the other location where you pick up quests. Several de uh, deter de what? I wasn't wow, deleterious. I wasn't ready for that word. So they're being cute about introducing me to both uh, taverns back to back. I see what they're doing here. You go to one, then I get a quest to go visit the other one, and your reward is that some characters sing. 